Hey guys, in this video let's talk about how to create captions. Okay, so there's a difference between subtitles and captions. So there's going to be two different videos. So let's go ahead and create captions. Go to File, New, and click Captions. So basically this is the industry standard and what we're going to do is create open captions and then we can basically decide whether these captions will be burned into the video or it can be closed captions. So let's create open captions and this is by default according to my video already imported. So let's click OK. And here in the effects controls, we have to go to window and select captions so we can see them. And if we go to project, we can find our captions right here. Okay. So we have to import it. We have to import them into the timeline like this. And if I expand this, right? So I get my first caption. So let's go to caption control and I can see that I can start typing so I can hear it. This course is for every single business. Da -da 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 -da. Could be my first one. So let me zoom in with the equal sign. Business owner, okay, and here I make a pause as so you can see in the audio waveform. There's a pause. Business owner, so this is my first sentence. If I want to continue right here, anybody that wants to build their brand, so let's click plus sign and write. For anybody who wants to create build their brand. Okay, so basically if you want to create another caption, you just hit plus sign, right? So it's simple. And then here, let me expand this. Here in the timeline you can see every single line that you write is a different layer. So if I want to start here, I can just move it here or I can expand it here or I can just uh, cut it here, for example. So if I click on each, you can see that they are switching. So if I click on the first one, now the first one is selected. Second one, the second one. So if I click on it, and here I can actually edit it, right? And I can also move the time code here, but for me it's much more efficient to just drag it, you know, and expand this this way. So I can continue throughout the whole video like this. And that's, you know, pretty much it. So the only issue right now is that captions look by default, they're black and white. So I don't like this. So what I gonna what I'm gonna do here we can see the options right so we see the font and the size the color and so on so if you want to change all of them at once right so just right click on any of it and click select all and now let's make them a little bit bigger so the size will be 45 nice oh, we can go 48 we can create the edge around like a stroke, you know, of course it looks horrible. Align spacing if we have more sentences. And now the text color, so it could be, it could be red. And now if I click here, I'm changing the attribute. So right now I can manage my and change my background of the text. Right, so this is just, I can make it bold, so this is just for um, demonstration. Of course, I would definitely, uh, probably not use 100% um, this kind of background. So here we can also put it on in the right center, 
and we can kind of position it right and let's say I want to make it slightly slightly more transparent right like <laughs> actually more like there's not transparent at, at all so I want to make it slightly transparent so I just go to effect controls right I'm still clicked on my captions and here you can see opacity so let's turn this down 88 mm, it's not much difference let me just go yeah 70 slightly better of course I can basically make them a little bit transparent as a whole so that includes the background and the text so that's a little bit of a downside right but you don't have to make it make it transparent it's not an issue or any problem with it so yeah I mean that's pretty much it and so now when you do captions throughout the whole video now you're ready to export it so basically you select your in point with I on the keyboard and then out point and simply hit command M is export media and of course you can't see uh, here you go so of course I didn't do subtitles and captions throughout the whole video so that's why here for example I can't see them anymore but here you can see them however this all stays the same as usual but here go to captions and export options burn the captions into the video so that means the video will not be changed so once you burn captions into it you can't get rid of them so if I unfold this create sidecar file that means the video it's like when you watch a movie that you download from the internet <laughs> and you want subtitles so basically you have one mp4 or whatever and next you have like SRT um, or any kind of other format for subtitles so once you put those two together and they are in the same name the subtitles load so basically it's your choice whether it's going to be in the video or not right so it's com entirely up to you and you decide basically so think about what you want to do and yeah then hit export and you're ready to go so thank you for watching and hopefully see you in the next video don't forget to subscribe